This is a quick walkthrough of my 1960 Morris Minor. You'll have to excuse the dog next door because he has spontaneous fits of barking all of a sudden today. But anyhow, it's just a quick walk around. Uh, as you can see, the paint is worse for wear, especially on the top, but actually a few places. Um, so the main things are there. And then there's little weird scratch things like this where the, I think the door didn't, wasn't quite adjusted right. And so some of the paint peeled off there. Uh, some of the fit of the doors and trim and stuff aren't exactly perfect. Um, and then here's some more of the bad spot. There's uh, some rust bubbling up under the hood here and a little bit here. Um, that's the main areas that I see uh, overall. I just was never happy with this paint job. I painted it myself probably 20 some odd years ago and it looked great for probably 15 years. And then I got another cheap paint job from a guy out in Visalia and it's never been right since then. He, he just didn't do a great job. Um, but you know, it looks relatively presentable from a distance uh, for the most part. Tires uh, are older but have lots of tread. They still hold air. I don't remember how long I've had them a long time. I uh, do have trafficators uh, that work somewhat intermittently. <laughs> uh, let's go inside. I'm going to show you the inside door panels. Everything's there for the most part. Sometimes loose. Snap them back in. Sometimes they'll stay for a little while. Could use a little adjusting. Um, but the door pulls and handles and windows all work as they should. A little bit of surface rust here on some of those parts. A uh, little banjo steering wheel. Um, and it's got the standard cracking around it. Uh, but the seats are in relatively good repair, front and back. Uh, it doesn't seem to get water inside, uh, which is nice with the one exception there seems to be some moisture or something on the front seal. Uh, the top of that gets, has something on there, like some kind of corrosion or something. Um, other than that, the headliner's good. Uh, for the most part, a little bit of dingy back there, but I think it'll clean right out. Uh, anyway, all the panels are here. Uh, years ago, this is my fault, years ago I put these speakers in used to have a little stereo in here and uh, it was a, a bad idea. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> but stereo is no longer here. But I leave the speakers there just there's not holes there and I haven't replaced those panels. Also the insides of the door uh, glove boxes are missing for the moment and that one the screw is obviously detached but they're missing on both sides. Uh, what else? The parcel shelf underneath is long gone. I took it out because I'm tall and my legs were hitting it. Um, also, incidentally, on that note, I um, took the driver's seat out and drilled a couple holes in the bottom of the car and re-screwed it down to give me more leg room because I'm six foot six and it wasn't going to happen.